Yeah, what's good cryptocurrency fans out there? Welcome back to the Everything Altcoin channel. Today, we're going to be talking about three low cap new crypto gaming altcoins I think you guys should pay attention to because they're going to be getting a lot of hype and they have been doing well. So, so before we get into talking about that, I'll to the, to subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already. We're on that road to 20k subscribers. If you guys want to help out with that, hit that red subscribe button. Don't forget to like the video, comment what you think about these three or what's your favorite three new low cap gaming all coins in the comment section down below and if you guys haven't checked out the discord you guys got to join it in that conversation that we're having that crypto conversation we're having daily and you can also ask your questions about how get how to get into some upcoming projects private sales because we get into a lot of projects private sales we've just recently did see a layer zero we got Sophia verse. There's a lot more that we've gotten that I just can't name off the top of my head as of right now. But there's so many projects that we're getting an opportunity to get into. You guys do not want to miss out on these upcoming projects, private sales, because we're getting to the cusp of the bull market. And once that comes around, these projects is going to get released in that bull market and experience the DJ market where you can make the most money out of them as possible. So check out that Patreon, check out the Discord, and let's get right into the video, guys. So first play we got for you guys is Player All, a uh, Player Bull, but they have it as a three there. Player Bull Games, right? This right now is at a $5.4 million market cap. Yes, the tokenomics to it does suck, but I'm looking at it more as in terms of the short-term trading. It can, it can run pretty fast, and it actually has ran pretty fast. As you guys can see, it's actually up 3.2% on the day, and it came out back in June where you could have got this at 0 0.0005 right now. And back in July, about July, let's say July 29th, it hit the high of just 0 0.002, right? So I think this has the potential to actually run it. And as you can see here, it hit its all-time high just 17 days ago, right? All-time low, it's actually up to pretty much 3x from its all-time low. So that would have been a nice sizable gain here. And they actually have been doing things with the community for you guys to actually play the game. And the game actually looks pretty good, right? The game gives me like that Gears of War, Halo vibe. This just was like just out in closed beta right now that you guys could have tested out. And they had a nice little live stream that they did with five influencers and they basically had a match with their um their community members five members of their community and they gave out a thousand dollars right so this is a good way to actually promote the game using your influencers giving cash prizes to the community members this is big in terms of people wanting to play the game and i believe that if you're able to show a streamable pro a product people are going to want to play the game a little bit more because that entices people people like to play what streamers play so i'm keeping an eye on uh player ball and i think that you guys should do the same thing as well and then next here we got game swift now game swift i've been telling you guys a lot about this is looking to become the immutable x of polygon chain right and you guys are pretty big fans of polygon right now game swift is at 11 cents i've been telling you guys this is going to go crazy yes this is also another one with the tokenomics does suck it is at a 4.9 million dollar market cap yes but even though the tokenomics sucks right now you can actually get some gains off of it if you're trading it within the short term and you're not looking to hold it for like three three years or so right uh, but like i said pay attention to that um that tokenomics there when you scroll down past 90 days here it has done decent right it was at about seven cents here and got upset about the high of 17 cents so that's not a bad a bad trade as well right and they actually have introduced some new games onto their system so the two new games on games with you like i said this is going to be a gaming hub on polygon right all games that want to build on polygon are actually going to build on game swift right First, you got Search of Animera, Star Siege, and then Flight Force 4, right? So these are going to be free-to-play games, which is always going to be good in terms of bringing in users. Now, they also partnered with um, Playway um, and Outer Life to actually bring in a new game as well. You guys can see this is the premiere trailer for this game. I think Game Swift is going to be something that people are going to want to pay attention to when it comes down to the gaming scene and cryptocurrency. Because you're going to have the hub of all the games here on Polygon, 
you go to their website you go to their little hub here you can see all games that you want to play into as of right now at one spot so this is something i'm really paying attention to i'm actually very much so excited on game swift because it's not just a single game it is a game hub for all games on polygon so let's move on to the last pick here now the last pick as of right now isn't on coin gecko or coin market cap just yet because it is really relatively very new here and they have actually i think they did a stealth launch or something like that but they haven't really been talking too much about it right these guys it is called army of fortune my recent video that you guys can check out in the cards up top right or in the description down below for you guys to check it out i made an in-depth video on these guys you do not want to miss these guys right these guys right now are members of the clash of clan team right the supercell team the founding members of the supercell team that brought out cash clans clash royale all these games they're now making a clash of clans like game for web 3 and with that team behind them whew, it's hard to bet against them after the success that they had with clash of clans you see you can see here they came out in july right and they have been a nice little uh stair step up really go up down go up and i think this is going to do the same thing here right now you can see it's at a two million dollar market cap fully diluted right they haven't gave us too much information on the circulating supply the website isn't out yet so this is probably the riskier play of the bunch but i think it has the biggest one of the biggest upside um the second biggest upside i should say because i do think um, game swift is probably going to have the biggest upside of the three and it's going to be army of fortune next here now this is what the game pretty much because right now you guys can go ahead and test out the closed beta and guess what if you test out the closed beta you're actually going to be able to get their other token which actually has better tokenomics than the RAFC token right that is the, I think it's the AFG essentially that is the governance token right so this gives you their clash of clan vibes on the mobile phone you can play it right now right I think this is going to get some hype where it's going to explode in price as more people start to find out about it. But you guys let me know about my three picks here that you guys should check out. If you guys don't like them, let me know your picks in the comment section down below. Of course, if you guys haven't subscribed to it yet, please do so. We on that road to 20k subscribers. If you guys want to help out with that, hit that red subscribe button and I'll check you guys later. Peace, YouTube.